Our final race of week 12 is race 39. It's a two mile six handicap, 0 to 120. So Nashville, Ridley for Vinnie Gerrard, our top weight outcry for David Robertson, Echo Bell for Alex Cherry, along with Maximum Mayhem. Fires at midnight for Martin Needham, Jadar with Stefano for James Shea, Hobson's Choice for Kevin Minahan, Sufalini Mullin for Paul Rhodes, Admiral Ascoli for Martin Needham, Victorian Elf for Thomas Rogers, Trouble Evelyn for James Shea, Kluger for Stu Gray, and Slaney upon for Thomas Rogers. 13 of them to go over two and a half miles and a bit. No start has gone them away. It's a pretty miserable day here. Pretty a lot of cloud cover. And as we wait for them to settle down in the sky handicap chase to get to the first of the 17. They're all over that. Here at Southall. Get to the second. They're all over that. And they start this uh, alongside the, as you can see, the chase course over the third. All over that, there's a few sticky landings. The, the fog and mist here is uh, not making it easy for the colours, but it's Hobson's choice that actually finally leads us with fires at midnight and Echo Bell. Towards the fence is Trouble Evelyn. And what Jadal is Stefano. Now followed through by Victorian L. Full and Outcry. Towards the fence here, I think, is Nashville Ridley. And the other grey in between horses out there is Admiral Escoli. It's a kind of turn right handed here. Through the first mile, it's Hobson's choice. From fires at midnight and trouble evening up against the fence, and Jadal is Stefano between horses and Echo Bell for Alex Cherry. Followed through by Victorian Elfall up against the fence, and the three of Sufalini Mullin, Maximum Mayhem, and I think Kluger. There's plenty here that uh, have not got a lot of room as they go over the fourth. So another 13 fences to take. It's Hobson's choice for Kevin Meanahan that leads us into the fifth. Jumps it well. The rest all over it as well from in second. Fires at midnight. Trouble even when he's outside between those is Jadal is Stefano. They're a length and a half away from out wide Nashville Ridley. As they all stumble over the six as well. And it's Hobson's choice taking a keen hold now and allow Trouble even to draw alongside along with Jadal is Stefano and fires at midnight. So they come into the seventh. Bit of a mistake there, I think, uh, by fires at midnight and he shuffles back. So it's Jadal is Stefano and Hobson's choice. These two are leading us. We're going to swing left handed again. By length and a half from Fires at Midnight and Echo Bell. And Trouble Evening and Sufalini Mullin now out wide. Up against the fence, I think it's Victorian Elfall. Kluger of Stu Gray being pushed through. Wider still is Nashville Ridley. Towards the rear is Maximum Mayhem up against the fence. And then the three just bringing up the rear of Slaney upon Outcry and Abmoy Scoli the Grey. Ten lengths from the lead up. We come inside a mile and a half. So it's Jadal is the star Stefano that just noses up and takes the eighth first. From Hobson's choice, a bit slow over that was far as at midnight. Into the ninth, or the leader went straight through the top of it and lost his lead, and let's Hobson's choice take it back up again. So Hobson's choice from Jadal is the star Stefano and Sufalini Maloon as they go over the tenth. These three leading all together. Jadal is Stefano just noses back in front. Sufalini Maloon and Hobson's choice two back to fires at midnight and Echo Bell and Victoria now full against the fence. Tr trouble Evelyn out wider than the right green silks of Victoria now full. Outcry Nashville Ridley, sorry that is the light green silks out wide is Outcry. And you've got Kluger in the dark, the Maximum Mayhem Slaney upon an Admiral Escoli still bringing up the rear. For the three up front, which is being led by Hobson's Choice now. As easy pushed along as we come down to the final miles. Hobson's Choice from Sufalini Mullin, Jadali Stefano. Fires at midnight and Echo Bell, they're your first fire. They're a couple of lengths away from David Robertson's Outcry and Trouble Eating on it inside, then Kluger. But up front, inside the mile, it's Hobson's Choice. Takes the 11th well from Sufalini Mullin in second. Fires at midnight, jumps himself into third with Echo Bell. Jadali Stefano starts to go backwards. They go over the 12th. These Leading five or six have got a three, four length advantage away from the chasing pack as we come down to six furlongs from home. And it's still this Hobson's choice, a little bit slow over this, but, but Sufalini Moulin moves into second, fires at midnight, Echo Bell, we've lost maximum, mayhem's gone. But it's Hobson's choice, leads into the 14th, which is three to jump. Hobson's choice from fires at midnight, Echo Bell, Sufalini Moulin, outcry's got much closer now. Trouble evening, trying to run on out of the back of the pack is Admiral Ascoli, the grey, along with Jadawis. Stefano, but this is Hobson's choice. Still leads for Kevin Meenan. Half a mile to run. Three to take, and it's Hobson's choice from Echo Bell. Fires at midnight. 
outcry still running on. Jadawi Stefano starting to go back with Sufalini. Mullin hasn't got a lot left, but it's Hobson's choice from Travel Evelyn that moves into second. Echo Bell on fires at midnight. Outcry Sufalini Mullin. Wide is Admiral Escoli and Jadawi Stefano. They go over the 15th, a slow jump by the leader. Hobson's choice, but here comes Travel Evelyn. Fires at midnight. The 16th, the penultimate. Hobson's choice fires at midnight. Travel Evelyn, he's starting to pull away from the rest. Fellow and a half to run, one to jump. Hobson's choice over it, a little bit slow. Fires at midnight, trouble evening between horses. Hobson's choice fires at midnight, trouble evening, a furlong left to run. Hobson's choice still got holding off now, trouble evening and fires at midnight. It's still Hobson's choice for Kevin Meenahan. Inside the final half a furlong, Hobson's choice. Hobson's choice boldly takes it, wins the sky handicap from trouble evening in the second, fires at midnight the third. Plenty of them didn't get into that. Last there was Victoria and Elfall. So a good win for Kevin Meenham picks up the last race of the week. With Hobson's choice. Trouble evening for James Shea was second. Fires at midnight for Marty Leedham was third. Looks like Echo Bell for Alex Cherry was fourth. And Outcry for Dave Robinson was fifth. We'll see you next week for the last week of Starters Order 7.